how to destroy droplets in digital ocean and cancel your current plan. End billing. The very first thing you need to do is sign into your digital ocean account and then click on the appropriate project which contains the droplet that you want to destroy. In my case, that project is going to be tutorials, which I'm currently in. Locate the droplet that you want to destroy from your services list. For me, I only have one droplet and that's called test-server. Once you've found the droplet from your droplets list that you want to destroy, navigate to the right-hand side and click on the three horizontal dots. Once you've done that, click on the word destroy. At the top, you'll see destroy droplet and underneath that, it will say, this is irreversible. We will destroy your droplet and all associated backups. All droplet data will be scrubbed and irretrievable. Underneath that, you'll see the words destroy this droplet and when you hover over it, it becomes a big red button. If you want to proceed with destroying your droplet, click on this red destroy this droplet button. If you want to power off your droplet, then I have a separate video on my YouTube channel which shows you how to power off or turn off your digital ocean droplet. I'll put it in the video description below and as a card at the top right hand corner of this video. If you want to continue with the deletion process or destruction process of your digital ocean droplet, click on destroy this droplet. You'll then be greeted with a small window which says destroy droplet. This will destroy the droplet and all backups. This is irreversible. All droplet data will be scrubbed and irretrievable. Enter the name of this droplet to permanently destroy this droplet. Underneath you've got your droplet's name and underneath that there's a text box which you'll need to fill in by entering the name of your droplet. So what I usually do is just copy my droplet's name and then I'll navigate to the text box underneath, left click on it, right click and then click on paste. Once you've done that, at the bottom right, there'll be a red destroy button. Click on it to continue with the process to destroy your digital ocean droplet. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to click on destroy. At the top right, digital ocean will then notify you in green that your droplet has been destroyed. You'll then be taken back to the project which contained the droplet that you just destroyed. Because I only had one droplet in the tutorials project, I now no longer have any digital ocean droplets or services in this project anymore, as of course I only had one. And that pretty much concludes the video on how to destroy droplets in DigitalOcean and cancel your current plan and billing. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a like, comment down below, and most importantly of all, subscribe to support the channel. I'll see you on the next video. Why is it so